So I have red, um, yellow, green, and orange bell peppers here. I also have some chopped onions and hot dog or sausages, whichever one you call it, and also some minced garlic. I have here also pork, minced pork, and this is what I'm going to use to make egg fiesta or egg frittata as some people may call it. I'm going to be using this frying pan and I'm using this one because it's small so my egg you know has height if you understand what I mean and also four eggs. So I'm going to heat up this pan now and add some oil to the pan. My mistake here was that I didn't use butter and the correct butter or fats I was supposed to use for this keto meal is supposed to be butter not oil but my dad also had some of this so you know I just decided to use this oil. So I'm going to fry the pork here in the oil and just you know pieces it so it's all scattered in the pot then i'm going to add the sausages and the reason why i am frying this first is because i wanted this one to be kind of dry and fried and i don't know how i explain it but i didn't want it to be soggy so i had to fry this first so it's like really done and kind of dry so i added my garlic to the pork and also some cameroon pepper I also added my um, sausages or hot dogs so everything you know is fried like I mentioned I don't like my meat to be I don't know if I should call it undone but I like it being like really hard and fried into like inside inside I don't know if you understand what I'm saying either so now I'm pouring in all my vegetables my bell peppers my onions and everything I chopped earlier I'm pouring them into the pan I'm just going to mix this up on low heat caution low heat because you don't want to overcook your vegetables so I am cooking this on low heat So after mixing that generously, I'm going to break my eggs so that I can whisk it and add it to my frying vegetables and I'm going to break four eggs now. I'm going to add some salt and some pepper to this so it has like its own flavor on its own. I mean like the spice on for the eggs stands out. So I'm going to add pepper because <laughs> I love heat and I love the heat so much. So when I'm done whisking this, I'm going to transfer this to the vegetables cooking and I wouldn't let it cook at all on the fire. Immediately I transfer this to my vegetables. I'm going to pop it inside the oven straight away. So I just poured this and you know spaced out the vegetables um with the eggs so everything is evenly distributed so after i'm done with that i'm just going to pop this in the oven right away to bake so when you're baking this i preheated my oven for 10 minutes on i think 150 degrees i don't know i'll check please <laughs> i'm not so good with that um calculation so this was in the oven for about 30 minutes you can let it sit for about 40 if you want and here it is done i did my fork in it and it was fine came out clean and you can cut this in any shape you want <laughs> this looked nothing like egg frittata it looked like pizza <laughs> okay it looked like pizza so pizza <laughs> so you can cut this into any shape you want and i just cut it into quadrants so i'm going to serve one for myself and this is so filling because it's filled with beef filled with um, sorry pork it's filled with sausages filled with um, bell peppers 